shit. Hey, Bill four five seven. How you doing? I had to take some pills that I forgot about. I heard the bell. That must be Bill J. Yeah. Is that what you hear, a bell? Hey, Madden. How are you doing, my friend? You going to stream tonight? Getting snow, five to seven inches. Wow, we're just getting rain. I should have guessed you guys know because I saw that the Giants played in the snow when they play in New Jersey. Who? Oh, first snow of the year. Hey, Brian, how you doing? You fix that oil seal? Yes, sir. Madding is excited about it as well. She missed streaming. Well, I'll try to make it there then, Mr. Madding, and be sure to give yourself some plugs, letting everybody know that you're going to be streaming that was quick i guess you were already into it when i called not doing nothing outside now oh you already got all your snow Wow, I guess it snowed from yesterday all the way. Alicia Ortiz, hello. Oh, Brian Hooper. <laughs> hey, Nick Waterhouse, how are you doing? Yeah, them Patriots kicked their own ass, didn't they? Ah, oh. still snowing here. Yeah, but you're, you're no. Up in northern New York, Alicia. I know I just got done reading this big long article on ESPN about Tom Brady and the Patriots and all that crap. And they have looked like crap. <laughs> Yeah, my damn Redskins win, who doesn't need, don't need to win, and my Patriots look like my Redskins. The damn Redskins, I don't know where the hell they came from yesterday. Jeez. I mean, it was just, they were just pretty amazing. 60 Minutes had a interview with the CEO of YouTube. Oh, I bet that was interesting. Hey, David Carlisle, how are you doing? Bill J. Verger 2, hello, and wanting to know if Big Flip can send you items for your channel giveaways. Uh, I guess if you want to, morning, guess who is fresh out of giveaway jail? <laughs> Alistair 
you crazy. I put a video up of it. Oh, I'll have to check that out, Bill 457. Was it interesting? Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't come on on Friday. I had every intention, every intention to come on. I was even at my computer. And I fell asleep. And then I get this damn phone call that wakes me up. And it's Brian. Hey, Nick Molnar. Hey, Beth. How are y'all doing? But it's Brian. He says, I thought you were going live today. I said, I am. He says, you know what time it is? It was like 10 minutes to four. <laughs> I said, no. I said, what, about one o'clock or something? And he says, hell no, it's 10 minutes to four. So I, I needless to say, I fell asleep on Friday and didn't make it. Uh, didn't make it to the streaming part of yesterday or of Friday. We have a lady as a CEO of YouTube. Oh, wow. Did not know that, Bill 457. It's okay. You needed the rest. All that turkey will do it to you. Yeah. Turkey and all that other stuff. My wife is such a good cook. But I hope she cooks something different tonight. <laughs> Yeah, Beth, I was just sitting here. I was, you know, just playing around with the computer for a little bit, and then I was going to go live. And then damn Brian, Brian called me and said, it's 10 minutes till four. I'm like, what the hell? I was wondering who the hell woke me up. <laughs> Nick Molnar says she has been... Uh, She's been the CEO for over three years. But we laying on the floor working on a new desk. It's wobbly, so putting in school. Hey, Tennessee Wendy, how are you doing? Now you know why the rules are strict. All right, hold on here. Let me let me see what's in this day thing. Whoa, look at that little bit of glue. Can't tell if these are rewraps or what. Oh. Hey, this trucker's life, how are you doing? Now, I don't think I'm going to be on tomorrow. My crown came in, and I got to go get that put on. Finally done with this nightmare load. Are you in the snow? No.
I know, I just got my tiara. <laughs> Yeah, where's Mr. Doba? No, was oversized. Oh. Get it, Crown Tierra. Uh, okay. I'm a little slow sometimes, Beth. Have to watch those bridges. Oh, yeah, them bridges suck. The bridges suck. Hey, Maddie, yeah, but I don't remember when it was. What it was, it was an end of stream giveaway about a month ago. Yeah, I saw Mr. Dope. Doughboy won a uh, microscope or something. I haven't seen him. Well, I've been watching a lot of football. And the game last night wasn't football. Hey, South Boston Gear. It's been a while. How are you doing? Hope things are doing okay for you. I imagine you're out there getting uh, getting snow too. How about them Packers? Yeah, they did a lot better. Old man trying to QB. <laughs> Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, well, your team didn't do too good either. And that's their national day to play. Used to be just them in Detroit. I have no clue what you're talking about, Mr. Matt. But Mr. Matting is going to stream tonight, so be looking out for him. Hubby is watching. Didn't look too interesting. Oh, uh, what, last night's? Hey, Rhonda, how are you? Victoria Roman Carr, what's up, my friend? Yeah, the Patriots really stunk up the place. No, I thought he was going to throw his helmet, but he just tossed it to that guy, that equipment guy. I've never seen him get upset like that. I'm doing good. Was debating doing halves or quarters today. Tons of rain and some snow. Hmm. Do whatever you can get the quickest and get back home with. Now she, yeah. Yeah, he looked a little, a little out of character. Hey, John Chum. 
I knew you were around here somewhere. Maddie was talking about you. I hope everybody I mailed stuff to got their packages a-okay. You have lots of snow. He's not used to losing. Yeah. And now Baltimore has the the lead for home field advantage for the playoffs, which I don't know. That's always been a big advantage. Pablo's Kitchen, what's up, my friend? All the way across the pond. Um, not today. Heavens are tough. Yeah. Pablo's got what's cooking. And do I got any new mail in here? Yeah, I'm Barry Will. It's mad cold here. Yeah, Nick, it's a whole stack of them. Max Scherzer rookie card. And uh, Hyun Jin Real rookie card. And then the rest is football. I was going to take pictures. And then I got a Corey Dillon graded rookie card in there. That's the tall one. Well, that explains it. The screws are too long. Won't be able to tighten this up until I get a bit shorter. They didn't come with the box. Where's Italian Eddie? Oh, yeah, Rhonda, I did that. Thank you. I don't see Italian Eddie. No, as a freebie desk, very loose. Oh, now I understand what's going on. There's Italian Eddie. Hey, Mike Wolf. Please, in her usual way, crashed out on the couch. Oh, I know how that is. That's all right, Eddie. Look at that, man. We're blossoming.
Yes, Mr. Doughboy, how are you doing? Congratulations on winning that microscope. I don't know where you won it. I can't remember that. No, John Chum, nothing today so far. Some ugly-ass coins inside there. There's there's Susan Lee. How was your Thanksgiving, Mr. Doughboy? You didn't fall or break a leg or anything, did you? Yeah, what happened to them boxes with all that damn silver? It was only a week ago. I am doing better today. Spare tire is back where it belongs, and the new tire is on. Well, that's good to hear, Mike Wolf. It's amazing how some of these coins are so thick. And some are so thin. I'm having all the boxes with silver sent to my bank. <laughs> oh, Alistair. That is not nice. I fell last Friday night. Oh, man. How are you doing? Are you okay after your fall? Dead again. I hate a non started car. Well, that's good, Mr. Doughboy. I got a new Lucky Charm for Silver. She's five to four. Did you have to blow her up, <laughs> Alistair? <laughs> uh, I got pink eye from Cindy farting in my CPAP max. I should be a millionaire. <laughs> yeah, I still... I still don't know what he's talking about. Bill, a lady friend gave me an 1881 New Morgan on Thanksgiving. Oh. Okay. Hey, Dragon Ken. How are you doing up in the mountains? You must have got a signal. 
That's where my wife went. She's five foot four. I think my wife's only five foot four. Hey, you know I gotta I gotta Alicia's back. Where did you go? Then they can work. I found a low W in Massachusetts S proof at work and a roll of quarters. Wow. Yeah, well, you all know that Ramon Juan sent me a Carson City half dollar that we're going to be giving away. I'm 6'3". Hey, Jeff Dunn. How are you, my friend? And then I want a WITPW from Silver Nitrate. Then I want a Walker from Ravenhawk. I can't be stopped. Went to eat lunch real quick. Oh, okay. Yeah, don't forget to eat. At least he hadn't been around for a while. But I'm glad she came home. Okay, now I'm paying more attention now. Love them CC coins. W. Hey, Crystal. I'm sure you're studying or something. Man. All these people come in here. I've been working my butt off. I noticed when you came into the stream, you had no butt. I said to myself, wow, what's different about Alicia? <gasps> she has no book. <laughs> I'm just good. Going to look at a CC today. You can't be needing that many more, Brian. Trust me. We need to CC. I will be rubbing my cat, the cupcake, and my lady friend for super duper luck. <laughs> Hey, Bradley Height. The crazy man from the desert. He opened up a hot dog stand. The 1889cc. Is that the rare one? I don't know. I don't have my book near me. How many people saw Bradley Hot cook the hot dog on a hundred ounces of silver? Damn, Brian, you are going to finish that set of Morgans. PCGS Extra Fine 40. Wow. He had to feed them hostages something. <laughs> yes. 110 ounces. Okay. The master of moles, the graphite king, the only man to cook a hot dog on 110 ounces of 2,000 degree silver ore. Bradley Height, what's up, brother? What will he come up with next? Did y'all see the Michelin man and the spark plug? I hope I didn't upset you, Alicia. 
since I made them jokes, I haven't seen you. Oh, okay. I was just trying to inject a little bit of comedy. Yeah, old Bradley comes up with some really ideas for some unique stuff. If you haven't checked out his videos for some of the stuff that he's been pouring lately, go check out Mr. Bradley Height. He's in blue right in the chat here. Yes, Mike, I lost one in 2010. I feel you, you never lose the memory or the heart you had for them. <laughs> well, thanks, Beth. I didn't know that. Don't forget to hit that like button. Uh, laughing out loud, my fear. No, no silver. Oh, nice link, Mr. Matting. IKR, I know, right? I can't wait to start filming again. I miss coin roll hunting. Ooh, silver Gumby and Pokey. That would be cool. Alicia, hang out when you can at the stream. I've got so many high quality donations that the giveaways are just going to continue to get better. Nathan T, just vlog this. How are you doing, Nathan? We have not found any silver yet today. Not feeling so good. Oh. Sorry to hear that, Beth. Pans up north where I was... We got like four inches at home. It rained, not snow. Wow. Yeah, and I got more coming. Michael Kittles is sending me a package. I wonder how many kids know Gumby and Pokey. Did y'all see what Madding just posted? 
Just letting everyone know that we will be streaming tonight. Fox Battles are back, y'all. Y'all, there's Michael Kittle. Actually, going out in the mail today or tomorrow, Bill J. Hey, Michael, thank you. I appreciate it. I might get something from you. I turned 21. I forgot to tell you all. Oh, well, congratulations, Alicia. Happy belated birthday and all that good stuff. I hope you didn't go out and get trashed. Whatever you do, don't drink and drive. Yeah, Alicia used to be a regular in the stream. And then she, I think she got another job or something, and she just had to start working a lot more. Bill, of course, who do you think I am? <laughs> My son is turning 21 in six days. Woo! King Queen Stacking, how are you doing? We're having a fun old day. I just wish Alicia a happy birthday. She just turned 21 recently. Haven't found any silver, down to 12, 12 rolls. Been one of them a crappy boxes. Yeah. My copper dragon round arrived. I'll be twenty one in a couple months. Hey, Kickstarter, how are you doing? I am too bry. I don't know what the hell that, what is bry? Did you ever get your envelope, Kickstar? People think I'm like 15. You always want them to think you're younger. 21 plus 34. What's that, your wife's age, Brian? <laughs> You're 21 and she's 34. Sure. Oh, uh, Anybody that's doing the um, Route 66 coins from Atmex, uh, a new one just came out today. The um, New Mexico Dinosaur Museum. Wednesday. <laughs> That's because you were uh, 
You were winning like a madman. Hey, Brian Wydell. The other package I got is the bow hair for my violin. Oh, I I thought I had uh, a couple broken prestige sets, but I can't find them. So I think I already uh, emptied out the coins. Route 66 banknote or cards. Saw the banknote, the thin thing. Do I have a coin scope? Yeah, right here. Yeah, well, that Atmex is the one that had uh. I just bought a prestige set at Saturday's auction for his cousin's funeral. Oh. Oh, Alicia, she's chilling out on the couch. I took her out before I came on. Prestige sets are pretty cool. Yeah, that's where I saw the New Mexico uh, Dinosaur Museum. So there's only two more coins after this New Mexico one, and that's Arizona and California. I want to get the whole set. Okay, king and queen. Yeah, I, I can't find them. They're not over here where they were, where they originated. So that means I think I might have popped the coins out and put them in this bag of coins I got here. Yeah, Bill, I have all of them through Texas and uh, on the 11th, I get my money and I'm going to order the uh, okay, Nathan. Thank you. Mr. Doughboy wishes he could get them Route 66 coins. Yeah. First time Monday. No, no silver. Hey, Coin Snobs, how are you doing? It's been a long time since you've been by. You sent in a donut and I gave away your coins and you never came back. Nice to see you. Do you put all 40% or 90% hamps? Do you find coin or hunt in a separate place? In the school, see how many you found this year at the end of December. 
Oh. Yeah. Uh no. I don't uh I just started counting how many I found. So I wouldn't know. I just put them into uh coin tubes and as I fill up a tube I put it into uh an empty penny uh not penny box an empty nickel box Hey Matthew Brian Hooper what were you saying uh, you want me to do a first timer Monday giveaway? Bill J, I finally got some stickers for you and everybody. Oh man, awesome. Yeah, I don't know. I've been doing this for like three or, or I'm getting close to four years. That's cool, cool snobs. Yeah, I ran out of my stickers, but I just got, uh, I just got a um a coupon code so i just got 50 of them for $20.14 from what the hell why is my brain just dying all of a sudden Sticker Mule. But they ain't going to be here till next week. Well, I appreciate it. I'm sure all the winners will appreciate it. Hello? Doing a lot better than you. Lower my insurance rates. <sighs> you can't lower my insurance rates. Somebody painted the edge. Painted the edge. Lily, is that you? Yeah, well, Matthew, if it was up to my wife, I'd have a lot less. She always tells me, why don't you get rid of that stuff? <laughs> hey Nick, that's crazy. They call you in Canada? Tennessee Tennessee Wendy, you you need to find uh a coupon. For sticker mule. 
And then you just order them. Yep, all the time on my cell phone. Wow. Yeah, let me check real quick, Wendy. All right, it's taking a while to load up. <laughs> yeah, Lake House Beach did my design a long time ago when he was doing it for free. Oh, hey, Empyrean label. Well, do you know Lake House Beats? You need to design. You need to design. You let me know, brother. Oh, yeah, he's done a lot of people's. He did uh, Brian Hooper's for me. If you've seen Brian Hooper's. Real cheap. Andy's quick. He used to come to stream, but I think somebody uh, scared him. Scared him. Starbuck Jeff, what's up, Jeff Concrete? No silver today, Nick. Brian Hooper, did you say do two giveaways today? Joe Durbin, what's up? The Minnesota Millionaire. How are you doing, Joe? We got skunk today. Okay. We're going to do two today. We're going to make up for Friday's uh, first timer. Friday uh, giveaway that I didn't do. I thought I was going to do it <laughs> until I got a phone call telling me what time it was. <clears throat> Your next videos will be about gold. <clears throat> 
Hey, Nick Molnar, I didn't understand that video about the devil's head. Was that, is that coin supposed to, or that bill supposed to look like a, uh, a devil's head? I didn't really get it. I'm waiting to see what. Yeah, I know. I know it was the hair of Beth, but I didn't see anything there. I told you I'm really hard. Yeah, the it was a Canadian banknote, and I just didn't get where. Yeah. Yes, Beth. It was one of Nick Molnar's uh, um, videos. Not that note, but 1954 notes had the face of a devil in her hair. Oh. It's there if you compare the two. Okay. Yeah, that just that had me really messed up. I, I went back and I watched it and watched it. And I'm like, what the hell? What the hell? My goodness. It's hard to see if you don't know what you're looking for. Yeah, well, I definitely didn't know what I was looking for, Beth. <laughs> I wonder where Ramon Juan is. Oh, that's where all the views come from. Yeah, exactly, Nick. Everybody's trying to figure out where the hell that double is. <laughs> oh, Nick, y'all crack me up. Crack me up. Oh, where the devil is a devil. Oh, I'm not looking up. Silver giveaways, how are you doing, my friend? Okay, Bradley Height, thank you for dropping by. Always love to have you. 
Love to have you too, Silver Giveaways. I'm just putting together uh, some giveaway piles. I think I might give away one of your coins in honor of you all coming by. I had a... Where is that? I'm sorry it's taking so long, everybody, but I got so many damn things. Well, not things, but coins. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to catch up on everything. Gosh. I got uh how was your Thanksgiving silver giveaways? That was a lot of hoes, silver giveaways. Everybody loves you, man. It's so nice of you to drop by. I can't see the date on that one. Why can't I see the date on these damn things? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Two, three, four. 
Okay, I gotta find another one. This is getting better. <laughs> we ate and fell asleep. It was good. Had kids here. Didn't do my sleeping until Friday. I was going to come on live. But I didn't make it. I got interrupted by sleeping. I don't even know how that happened. Let me see how many I got here. One, two, three, four. So I need one more. I'm so glad you all were able to drop in here to say some hellos. It's so nice to see you. Oh, I forgot about Beth's coins. Lord, I got so much stuff in here. Um, Tennessee Wednesday, Wendy, Wendy, I keep calling you Wednesday. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're doing Snapple. I'm going to, I need to buy a new red book. And when that new red book comes in, I'm going to start going through it. It should have some more facts than what my 2018 version has. So that's why I'm trying to hold off on some of the uh, bigger coins because I want to do coin trivia. You can never be hooked up without enough. Hey, Roadrunner. Well, let me put that back in there. I forgot all about Beth. We'll throw a couple more in tomorrow, Beth. But I just let them trickle through. It'll be easier tomorrow. I've only got to do like one coin per per, per donator. I'm deeply hurt. I know you're just kidding. You got to write your name on the back to get ups. <laughs> yeah, don't fear. 
uh, Red Book Trivia will come back. I am looking to buy this first sign I see that the uh, Red Book Trivia is available or the new Red Book out to 2021 because it's always a year ahead, I believe. I am going to buy it and then we will start about Les Wiley made it in today. Holy cannoli. He's been off the radar for a while. <laughs> I gotta refresh. I gotta refresh too. I need some water. Michael Kidney is here twenty. Well, I could use the twenty twenty, but uh, I think the twenty twenty ones would be coming out, and um, I would just go ahead and get one of them, and then I would be current for a couple of years. Plus, I noticed that they had the, uh, oh, it'll be out in April. Mm. All right. Well, Michael, just let me know how much I owe you for it, and I'll get you some PayPal. Or when I post my email address, just email me uh, your PayPal, and I'll give you the PayPal. I didn't know it was going to be that long. I thought it would be like around Christmas time. Because no, I mean, I started the channel growing up in the uh, the Red Book trivia. And the Snapper was just a thing because I kind of ran out of finding questions. Oh, cool. And if you got the spiral kind, I like that a lot better than the paperback kind. Uh, I really appreciate that, Michael. That way we'll be able to get back to some uh, get back to some uh, coin trivia. Thank you so much. Thank you, Madding. I just got to pick out a couple questions. Mr. Doughboy, you can't win. So I can answer that question. <laughs> oh. Wow. Wow. Okay. We're going to do two giveaway. One's first timer Friday makeup. And then the first one's going to be just the regular old uh, giveaway. Hey, well, you missed us going through the box, John Salisbury, but we're getting ready for the trivia. You missed that.
Does anybody know whether they're eligible or not? Hey, massive corn roll hunter. Bill. But no, this is the regular giveaway. Matthew, hold on. Kickstarter coins, you still got some time to wait. Victoria, you got to wait some. Nick Waterhouse. Nick Waterhouse, you still got to wait. Stacking, hoarding, tinkering, fun. Rafe Alman. Terry Kellogg. Matthew, you are eligible. Matthew, do you hear me? Did I just say you couldn't? Oh, I'm sorry, Victoria. The, I was looking at the wrong one. I, I looked at your the win for the big silver one. Matthew, you can play. And Victoria, yeah, you're good to go. All right, Jeff, we'll... I'm just getting ready to push enter. Sorry, Victoria. I was looking at your big silver win. Okay, you all ready? You can't answer this, Mr. Doughboy. What is the only one-syllabled state? I guess I could have been. So giveaways. Good luck, everybody. Thank you. Oh, I didn't even tell you all your prizes. All right, Matthew. You can't win anymore for 30 days. Matthew took it real quick. Matthew, let me tell you what you won. I forgot to do that. Did everybody know that? Matthew. And then I'll tell everybody what the first timers are playing for. Courtesy of Beth Coddington, you got a 1943... P. Warnickel. Courtesy of Bill J. You've got a 1929 Philadelphia Buffalo Nickel.
courtesy of Mr. Ramon Juan. A 1943S Mercury Dime. And a courtesy of Ramon Juan again. A 1962 Benjamin Franklin half dollar. No, and then courtesy of Brian Hooper, a 1908 V-Nickel. You also get to pick some stickers, but I'm going to do that after the first timer giveaway. Bill 4657, Bill J, a little tip. Do not say the question. Every time Google hears the question, I get it quick. What do you mean? Don't read it out? All right, well, now you can't win for 30 days. Oh, okay. Now it's first timers giveaway for the people that have never won. Like you, Susan Lee. Courtesy of Bill J, we got a 1936 Buffalo Nickel. Courtesy of Ramon Juan, a 1942 Mercury Dime. Hey, Levi, haven't seen you in a long time. It's been ages. Courtesy of the number one loved Streamers in our YouTube today, Mr. and Mrs. Silver Giveaways, a 1942 Philadelphia Walking Liberty Half Dollar. She looks a lot better when you get her in front of you. And then courtesy of Brian Hooper. Oh, a 1908 V Nickel. <laughs> Oh, roofing season is over. Bring on the commune community. Oh, cool, Levi. I'm sure you'll get some more work days in. Alicia, I got a lot more walkers to give out. So you just come hang out every day. I don't know when I'm, they're going to be giving out or what. And then one more courtesy of Brian Hooper, a 19... 78S proof deep cameo Roosevelt dime. My dinner is done, so I'm going to go eat. Good luck to all first timers. Oh, uh, okay. Um, where did I just read that? I'm still waiting on my walking liberty. Where did I get lost? Oh. Raymond Longy is here. Oh, there he is. Hey, Raymond. <laughs> it was me, Bill. Dave's not here. Ah, uh, they've been do doing good and bad. Found a lot of silver the week before Thanksgiving. Found a little bit during Thanksgiving week and started this week out with the skunk. Let me type in this first timer giveaway. Tennessee Wendy, this is the kind of giveaway for you.
Levi, you've won in the past. <laughs> You've never won, Levi. Hold on. I know it's been a while since you've been here. Still in shirt. Don't see him. Ha uh ha, -huh, your mom, never see him anymore. Christian Coins, never see him. Oh, Roadrunner one. Victoria. John Wolf, who's your hillbilly? Haven't seen him in a while. Field guy, I don't think he'll be back. Joe Baca, never seen him anymore. John Oof and Blood X, John Salisbury. Paul of Bloom. Ah, uh, when this is when the horrible, horrible summer started. There's Bill 457. He won on August 30th. There's Ramon Juan. Just spitfire. Look at all these people. Oh, that's when my camera broke. Oh, that was horrible. Huh. Well, <laughs> you right. You are right, Levi. Good luck. Don't believe everything you read. I won by default. The book spelled out a parallel answer. Dang. At least he did better than me. I went to the bank to get some quarters and an old man backed into my car. Oh, that sucks. Just sold that proof at my coin auction. All right. Whoops. I see a typo. All right, you first timers. Here we go. And then Matthew, come back to pick out some stickers. Bam. The Saturn V moon rocket consumes how much fuel per second? Yeah, I got a ton of stickers. Oh. Hey, Willie the Coin Viking.
I'm going to say a gallon. It's a hybrid. <laughs> All right, we got to go by the answer that uh, listed on the cat. And so far, nobody has got it yet. Okay, everybody, you can have another guess. Powered by Tesla. Hey, Ashes C4, how are you doing? Scroll up and you can read the trivia question. And uh, maybe you can win a nice little pile of coin. Hey, hey, howdy. Less the same answer ain't gonna be right. There you go. That's what I've been trying to say. Look at this guy. We have a winner. Starbuck Jeff. Um, Ashes C4 already got Snapple Real Fact number 913. The Saturn V moon rocket consumed 15 tons of fuel per second. I don't know how many gallons that is. I don't know, but Ashes C4, congratulations. You are a first time winner on Bill J version two's channel. Yeah, so uh, Ashes and Matthew, y'all ready to pick out some stickers? Yeah, you, but we got to go by what the Snapple lid says. Yeah, well, I was read it said 15 tons. So 15 tons will be 30, what? 30 pounds or 30,000 pounds? That's what big gas tank. <laughs> it sure is, Beth. Thank you for dropping in today, Nick. You have a great day. All right, I'm going to start going through these uh, stickers. When you see one you want, you just tell me. Okay, we got, first off, we got Amanda, coin and card hobbyist with the fish. And then we got Cherie Ward. These are brand new stickers. I just got the uh got them in the other day. How have you been, SJ? It's nice to see you. Then we got Mr. Bradley Height, bad man from the desert.
Yeah, bye, Joe Durbin. Thank you for coming by. And then we got Victoria Roman Carter with Tweety Bird guarding her silver stack. Then we got Scrapping, Hoardering, Tinkering Fun. I can't get that. And then Brian Hooper. The madman from North Carolina. And then we got TLT. TLT Coin Hunter. These are brand new. I just got them too. You, uh, you get to pick one more, um, Ashes. Hold on. And then there's one left of Bill J version two. Yeah, these answers always cause some kind of controversy. Controversy. Then we got SJ's Mixed Adventures. Oh, Matthew, you want uh, one of Amanda's? Now y'all get to pick one more. Yes, I still have a couple of your stickers to give away. Then we got Mr. Doughboy, 356. Oh, uh, Tennessee Wendy, that was uh that was just UPS. They always just leave it on the front porch. Brian's World and Mechanic. Now these two count as one. We got the awesome silver giveaways. Get you some Harley Davidson sticker with the Walking Liberty. This is modeled after David Lee's panty dropper bike. And then also, we've got the Silver Giveaways Dream Catcher. I Dream of Silver. This was designed by Susie's son. Yeah, get you some. But if you pick that one, you get them both. And then we got just another average stacker. Nick Molner. These are actually postcards that he cut. And then we got Madding, our crazy mod. Carlos on call. Mama lose coins. The crazy man from uh, Pennsylvania, Dime Digger. The lovely Maya's Coins, a.k.a. Coin Karma Crew. Oh. <laughs> and then the Raging Cajun, Cajun Coin Hunter. And last but not least, I've got one Paula Bloom sticker left. So both of you guys, Matthew and Ashes, pick one more. SJ, since it has the heartbeat.
Okay, Mrs. J, I only have one left after yours. Or after this. So if you want to send me more, I'd appreciate it. Matthew, how about Dime Digger for the second one? All right. If I can find it. Dime Digger was closer to up here. Ah, there he goes. All right. Yes, the raging Cajun is cool, and he's crazy. Well, if you want to send me any stickers, SJ, I'll be glad to send them, them out. I didn't multiply for both Ev and Engine. Oh, the mermaid is special. I wonder if I can make cardboard. All right, I'm going to tape these down into... Uh, they're cardboard, and then I'm going to get off the stream and see if I can make it to the bank. You can only get the mermaid from giveaways from SJ. Oh. That's cool. Hey, Lily. You have a... Uh, a wrench as a sticker. Come on the other side, Lil, so people can see you on TV. Over here. Mudsort's a young buck. We don't know. We've never seen this face. 15 inches of snow. I wonder who that is. tonight come over here come here Lil thank you everyone you all made it a great stream 
Lily. What's his name? Phil Timmy. Timmy. Timmy's in the well. Timmy's in the well. That's what Lassie used to cry. Ask C4, you got to uh, send me your, come over here. Thank you, Brian Hooper. Come over here, Lil. Yeah, up here. Here she is. Are you looking for food? Tell them, yes, I starve you. He's starving me today. Oh, we got skunked. I found a lily, though. Come on. Come on. Whoa. They're all saying hi, Ellie. Don't be rude. Yeah, we got skunked, SJ. But that's all right. We had fun. Got a lot of people popping in. Lily, I'll be there in a minute. Oh, okay. Look at Tennessee Wendy got it. I just typed it in there too. I added the dot com. Boy, what a fun stream. Thank you, everybody, for dropping by. I swear it's nine real quarters. Only found two W's. I have one dollar in my account. That's because you've been going to uh going to Mexico. I'm glad you ain't getting messed up with those damn uh, drug cartels. All right, now I might not be here tomorrow. I gotta get my tooth. My crown came in and I gotta go get that put on. <clears throat> And I gotta see if I'll be able to make it. Yeah, I'm so glad you don't get messed up with them drug cartels. That's some. Um, Ashes C4, are you in Tennessee? Bristol, Tennessee. Home of NASCAR. The Bull Ring. Uh, 
Oh, you're up just over in Virginia? Oh, okay, SJ, so you're talking to the other Bill. I was going to pour, but Bill J went on. <laughs> Well, thank you for stopping in, SJ. I'm sure you'll get your pores in. Damn, I got this all screwed up. I'll be fine. I have other accounts. Winter storm 93, no power, four days. I am deciding on whether to put a hundred dollar order in. A hundred dollar order with SJ. Oh, you got your power back. Way to go, mud sweat. I hate losing power. Oh, at Atmex? Yeah, I can't do that till the 11th. I can get me... Uh, that newest Route 66 coin. I'd like to get that little container I got that holds the Route 60. I oils have my new place in less than two weeks. What are you moving and start, SJ? My oils have my new place. Oh. So your mom's moving with you?
Ah, oh, well, congratulations, SJ. Oh, okay. What the hell's a voucher for? Hey, Ramon Juan, how are you doing? Now we got skunk today. But we had a had or having a great chat. A lot of people stopped in today. It was a very good. How was your uh turkey day and how was your weekend? Been very busy at work. Yeah, no kidding. You're the hardest working man on YouTube. I waited 10 years. Okay, I might not be on, Levi. I got to... Uh... I got to go get a crown put on, and if I can get to the bank this evening, then I can probably stream, but if I don't go until tomorrow, uh, cool, Ramon. Man, I got a ton of stuff. I gave away a couple of things today. You were so awesome, my friend. Silver giveaways dropped in for a little bit today. I don't know if they're still here or not. Okay, Tennessee Wendy, you too. Oh, is your birthday on the 11th? Yeah, that's a Wednesday. I should be able to. David Lee and Susie are still here. Get this. A 1920 Mexican 50 centavo goes for 467 grade. All right, SJ. Yeah, Coin Snob has been here pretty much all day. So, Bill 457, what'd you say? They had Peace Dollars BU for 20 bucks. <laughs> That's probably uh it's 
probably for a 1922. How long were you without power, Mud Swat? Hey, Susan, thank you so much. Too bad you can't bottle the smell of that alpha alpha. Alpha smells good. Sweet smell. I've never smelled it. Brian Hooper's still here. So, Bill, you're going to get a roll of silver dimes for 65. Yeah, you know, I'm here till the end, but my internet lags, so saying it now. <laughs> oh, okay, Susan. So, Bill 457, the one thing about AppMax, they charge sales tax. I had a customer who forgot to bathe. Oh, Lord. Boy, that's got to be pretty funky. I wonder if that Matthew sent his email. Oh, damn it.
NASCAR. Hey, Anna Hutchison, how are you doing? You're lagging very bad. That sucks. Hey, Harry Humstone. Yeah, I got to get a crown put in, and if I don't get to the bank today, it'll depend on when I get up and get to the bank tomorrow, whether I will be able to stream and then get to the doctor's or the dentist time to get my crown in. I don't know. I can't wait to get rid of this temporary one. Hey, Anna, I'm doing okay. Getting static. It's a little better now. What's up, everybody? Well, we got skunk today. But we did uh, both giveaways. A first timer. I have to get to the dentist, too. Yeah. That's why the snow is white. Make believe it's shaved milk. My parents been all out all day. Well, that stinks. Tell me it hurts more strong meds, please. Your gums hurt. Gum disease is worse than something wrong with a tooth. They didn't give me no pain meds when they gave me the temporary one, Ramon. Actually, I had uh, meds already. I got to go to that doctor on Thursday. And then I got a doctor's on the appointment on the 12th. I know I won't be streaming on the 12th. I'm trying to get all this stuff done before the beginning of the year. Beginning of the year, so I don't have to pay my deductibles that quick. I don't have gingivitis mud swat. Well, to me, a crown is something major. <laughs> okay, much what? I did there is every six months. for a checkup and a cleaning. I was talking about <clears throat> Gum pain is not good. I had gum pain from my crown. 
because I kept biting on the drill and he drilled uh, he drilled into my gums oh and still a little scent I don't have to get my gum scraped I don't have gum disease. What the hell you need kerosene for? You don't have no heat. Why don't you have any heat? If my car goes back out, I need heat. Ah. Oh. <laughs> so what's the cam scene for? A temporary heater? Bill J's lurkers. Hello all. <laughs> That's funny, Ramon. What's the temperature in Arizona, Ramon? Oh, kerosene heater. What the hell did they take all your teeth out for? Man. I'm learning too much information, Bill 457. We have septic in a well. 63 degrees. Oh, man. Oh, 50 in North Carolina? I know it's 40s here. I know it's it's not it's not in the 50s. I look at the 10 day forecast. We're not gonna hit 50s again for uh, like 15 days. I got everything seasonally. It's all pretty much winterproof. 70 in Florida. Oh. Well, that's even a little chilly for you, David Lee, isn't it? Thirty-six degrees in southwest Indiana. <laughs> Too cold. Thirty five degrees. In the AM, it is. Oh. 
Yeah, I gotta go take Lily out. Ugh. What's what's got thirty one degrees and he has to go shovel snow? Go buy some kerosene. Gonna be about 45 from our man silver giveaways. Time to break out the flannels, sheets, and pajamas. <sighs> Just use the blowtorch. I'm sure Brian Hooper can hook you up with one or fix you one up and sell it to you. I don't know. I want I don't I wonder how many pe people he has that has snow blowers. Brian, do you have any clients that bring in snow blowers? I know in the weather wild especially in this big-ass United States. Sell some of that silver hoard, but what? I know. I just watched a video of his of all the free silver he got, man. Shoot. No snowblower customers. Nope, I'd rather dig. Keeps me in shape. The hell with that. I'd rather have my kids do it. We don't have snow blowers. Some people around here have them, but we really don't get that much snow around here. I made that mistake once. I don't want to do it again. What was that, Mud? Selling your silver? Hell, I hear that from my wife must be once a week or once every other week. Yeah, that was crazed. Well, guys and girls, 
it's going to be dark here before too long. Let me uh, let me get off here so I can take uh, Lily outside. All right, I will try to make it on tomorrow, but if I can't make it, I will see you Wednesday for sure. I have no appointments on Wednesday. And then I got an appointment on Thursday. So I might not. See you, Brian. Today was a lot of fun. I had a lot of nice people here. You too, David Lee. You all stay warm down there. Starting out at 45 is rough. I do too. I'm getting a gold crown. Ramon, thank you for dropping in. Again, thank you for all your donations and all that. I will try to make it on tomorrow, but I just don't see myself making it to the credit union and then the bank and everything today. Warmer than most. Absolutely, Silver Giveaways. Tell Susie we said hello up here. Yeah, Mudswack, go get your kerosene before the damn power goes out again. Yes, goodbye to everyone. Bye, Ramon. I don't know where you went. Okay. Yeah, hopefully I see you uh, when I stream again. You too, Ashes. Bye, Ramon. You're awesome. Take care and don't work too hard. Okay. I'll catch you all tomorrow, Holy, if not Wednesday. Bye.